Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Beta Channel, which is the build at 22635.4300. The Beta Channel is still on Windows 11 23H2, but of course, soon enough, it will move on to 24H2 most likely. In this video, we're going to talk about all the new features and changes that we can encounter in the latest build for the Beta Channel. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to Tech Based Channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, as I've said, in the beta channel, we have the new updates related to the shared files. And in addition to having profile images and icons, and also more details about certain people that share files with you, you have also a hover menu that will allow you to see the profile of that certain sender, which is pretty interesting. But of course, this is in a early stage right now. So it could be bugged. If you're on the beta channel, of course, you can test that out if you want. In addition to this, in the file explorer, in the navigation pane, right now, if you right click on something, for example, desktop, we're going to have the new option, new and folder. You're going to be able to create a new folder directly from here. This is basically a new context menu option from the file explorer that you can use. As you can see, I just created a folder really easily on my desktop using this context menu from the navigation pane. In the start menu, the all apps section is now called just all as you can see. This change began rolling out with the previous build. I think this is pretty interesting. Microsoft is also adding a new simplified Chinese font. More info about that in the article below if you're interested. And we also have a security improvement related to Windows search and about that you can also find more info in the article below if you're interested because this is something a bit technical and also if you have the widgets enabled in your taskbar you're going to notice the new clock widgets countdown and timer which can be used of course in the widget section we also have two fixes in the beta channel one of them being Microsoft fixing a high hitting explorer.exe crash impacting insiders while using your PC in the last few beta builds and also in the file explorer Microsoft is fixing an issue which was causing the items in the navigation pane to become very spread out with unexpected padding between each item for some people. There's also two known issues. After installing this build, you may find there is an unexpected amount of spacing between items in the start menu all apps list. And also after installing this build, live captions will crash if you try to use it. This is basically everything that is new and that Microsoft is testing right now on the beta channel. So if you want to learn more about this and see more information, you can always check out the article below or the official Microsoft article from their website. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. This is Manny from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.